we also have found out the possibility of who Bon Skinny's mother is. Hello everybody, how are you all doing? In today's video I'm going to be doing another little factual moment on Bon Skinny because basically I am now very interested in the story even though it scares me the fuck out but I'm very interested and I want to know more so if you guys know any more information let me know below or you can contact us on our Instagram or my personal Instagram if you would like to basically over the last week a lot has happened I've had some more information from you guys I have looked on Reddit and she's updated her account we're going to talk about her updates to her account first and then we're going to go on to what you guys have told me this video is a lot by the way so stay tuned in her recent instagram since i last posted her face has not been in it physically however her voice has been i think it's been like one or two posts where her voice has been in it but the main one involves her using a sock puppet it kind of looks like her with the red hair herself well her face isn't in it the sock is but basically there is a sock puppet and a drain that you can see the sock puppet calls mr man stupid and then Bonnie goes, no, he's not stupid and kind of freaks out and gets scared as though he can hear it and she's going to be in a lot of trouble, which we don't want because she's clearly in a lot of trouble and we don't want to make it worse for her. Then later on in the same one, you can clearly see more of the room, which is broken and the wall is falling off. The drain is clearly part of the room. Like that's The drain's fucked up, but it's part of the room and the sock puppet throws a piece of the wall that's broken off the piece breaks and then she's like oh no i've broke the wall as though she is in trouble gonna be in trouble because she broke the room and that's making me think that she is in the room because she's done something wrong and she's not allowed to touch anything just play with this puppet which looks like her which may be a little bit of a clue to something but basically my thoughts on that are she's in her room because she's done something wrong and she can't touch anything so she's just kind of chilling with the sock puppet and drain and if she breaks anything, then Mr. Man is gonna hurt her. The following post after that involves single ca single letter captions which spell out surgery. Apart from the last one, which is R-Y, which I need to figure out. If any of you have figured it out, let me know. The S post to this little word spelling moment. So the S post involves a boiler room. It looks like a boiler room, it's hard to tell. Followed by a star at the end which flashes up very quickly, as though that is a symbol for something. Whether it's for the devil, I'm not sure. However, the upload or the, the sound that is used in this, it is very clear that they are a part of this. People are wondering if this account is Bonnie because the bio says 666 Bonnie. Which again, leads me to think that the star in the video could be some kind of connection to the devil. Or satanism and honestly i kind of think it could be because there is a lot of sounds on there which sound like her screaming or making a noise she's got a very unique voice i think or i'm very used to hearing her voice so if i heard it in a video i'd be like that's bonbon that's our bonnie and so i really think that this is bonnie or is connected to bonnie or her account in some way shape or form the most recent post to this account which is a series of numbers which obviously spells something but I didn't get time to write that out because I, I was at work but it spells something out and that one is called Scary Man Keeps Me Here which again very much sounds like Bonnie but another TikTok also is captioned with the account I'm watching him now which is another ARG slash horror account which has another story to it and I'm wondering how are they connected? Are they really connected or are they just working together to give each other more notice? There is a, in a live show, Bonnie was actually cutting things and she says something about cutting someone's hands and I'm wondering, is this connected? Probably not, but I'm just wondering, like, I just overthink things and I was just wondering, is it connected in some way? How is this other ARG connected to Bonnie? Okay, so, the you post in this little surgery little spelling time is using the is using a sound from the previous account which is linked to Bonnie and it just shows a perfect face and I think that as this goes on 
it almost feels like Bonnie is going, could be having surgery, really wants surgery, which she's mentioned before. I genuinely think something is going to happen surrounding her surgery. Is she going to change her mask? Is she going to do a face reveal? I'm not sure, but something is going to happen talking about the surgery, okay? So the R post shows a girl, well, or a doll with red hair and the writing across the forehead, which is very similar to Bonnie, and I think... This symbolises Bonnie getting surgery or wanting surgery, like I've just said. Then the E is written as a three and it just shows a perfect girl on IMVU, which shows Bonnie as a perfect girl or how she thinks a perfect girl is with the red hair, um, you know, bigger lips, you know, that kind of thing. So the R and the Y uses a sound which sings about being schizophrenic, which I don't know if that's because it's they like the sound or if it's just saying that she has a mental illness but it's very strange as this is the only one which spell which is not showing a perfect face or mentioning a perfect face it just is ry schizophrenic which there's definitely more to that which is why i think i'm going to end up doing a part three there are two posts after this which pe people are thinking that bonnie has been seriously hurt and somebody else is posting for her these two posts include one which is just a plain, just nothing really. It looks like a grill, almost like a floor grill. And then another one which says, go to the Instagram, which is a new one, but it says to go to the Instagram. If you go to the Instagram, you will see today she uploaded a story which connects to, which connects an account which has a photo of Bonnie from the 18th of February saying that Bonnie needs help and something serious is happening. Also on this account is a post which shows a screenshot from the Discord, which I'm not part of. Mr. Man is going to be taking all her stuff away until she's passed GED, which is kind of schooling. She want, And he wants her to pass that so that he can have her out basically and get more money and just have her out. Which leads me to, again, is Mr. Man being worse to her because he wants her out? And that is why in the more recent videos, she has been seen in a diff in a meat cellar maybe or which is why she's been more worried about breaking the wall and stuff like that so the next piece of information is taken from reddit and i'm going to be taking this telling you guys because i just i just want to know what you guys really think of what's going on or what i'm telling you and you can help me decipher things okay if you go back through her instagram or tiktok it wasn't really saying which one she has a photo of her from 2005, which has four candles on it, indicating she was born in 2001, meaning she is either 18 or 19 at the time. Then they also on Reddit mentioned the photo of her of Mr. Man on her Instagram has made people think that he is abusing her in a certain way. I don't want to say how, um, because he has some kind of handguard and there are photos of her on top of him and her in love with him. Obviously some people like, is she being assaulted in a certain way? And honestly, I don't know. So let's get on to what you guys have told me and get on to the real beef, okay? Recently, she did a live on Instagram and she was seeing all the comments saying she needed help and stuff like that. She then said she doesn't that she doesn't listen to us and only Mr. Man because he has a gun, which is why she isn't getting help because she's scared of Mr. Man because he has a gun. In all of the more previous videos that he has a gun and she had it against her head. So he's not afraid to use that. She was then heard cutting with the camera down and when asked what she was cutting, she said her fingers. But I didn't hurt her, Mr. Man did. And I'm wondering, is there another girl in this story and is this how... The other girl from the other ARG is connected. Probably not, but I'm wondering who is it that Mr. Man hurt? We don't know. I've only ever really, we only ever know of Bonnie as the other female and the other girls in the house, which is from a way older video. Who is the girl that she is cutting the fingers off? Then, and then we also have the possibility of who Bonskinny's mother is, which, oh my god. So. Bon Skinny's mother may be the Debbie, which we have spoken about. Some people think Debbie is Bonnie. However, in a live show, apparently she said that Debbie is her mother. Through this, people have found, or a viewer has found, 
a missing female called Debbie and when asked about it, Bonnie blocked her. The female that Bonnie thinks is her mother is a genuinely missing person who has Crudon syndrome and has never been found, which is why she may be in the care of Mr. Man. I don't know if I can say the mother's name, but it is Debbie. Like, it is Debbie. And there is a Debbie, and it is her mother. And fans may have found who it is. And I found this out through a viewer who was very nice and actually met, and actually DM me and was like, I love your videos. Like, thank you very much. And thank you for your help. But um, I don't want to mention the woman's name just because um, I don't know if I can and I'm scared but I just want to keep myself safe and also if it's not her mother I don't want to be mean if it's not her mother you know but it seems like this is her mother and she genuinely doesn't want to talk about it because she's blocking fans who, who ask her if it's her mother. Now we are on to the final bit of the video which is kind of not as much as the rest of it okay bonnie did an interview with somebody who was on reddit apparently and revealed some things something that a redditor also said about bonnie's mental health this user found that she has M mnd which is neurological disorder which causes weaknesses in walking talking and a posture which we can clearly see in some of her videos she may have cruisal syndrome or she may have mnd we don't know she may have both she may only have one i don't know now let's go on to the interview because it kind of debunks this however do you believe that bonnie is telling the truth here in an interview she has said it is an arg and it sort of symbolizes her face because she genuinely hates how she looks she does have a facial deformity so she could have cruise on syndrome in real life anyway however she doesn't didn't really mention how safe she actually is and then regarding the scars and the cuts it is a form of self-harm which is probably because of her facial deformity which could make i think does make sense too because when you are in a certain mental state you kind of do things to yourself so the account she started in 2018 where she only gross posted gross stuff and stupid stuff and her inspiration is shay st john which you know she is probably just comment co almost copying his stuff and creating his stuff since you since he's her inspiration and then obviously it grew to something she can't control anymore and it's caused her a lot of anxiety and she didn't really see it coming which I kind of feel bad for her, like, either way, because she's either really, really hurt or her anxiety is very bad and she's self-harming and I feel bad for her, okay? So that is all the research I found. Um, I still don't know if it's real or if it's an ARG. I think that everything is just a lot in this story, I think. I think this story is just opening a ton of loopholes and just there's just endless amounts to this story there's just so much connected to it and i don't think i'll get to the end of it i'm constantly finding new information about it so there will probably be a part three i'm not gonna lie there's probably gonna be a part three next week because there's just no end to this story <laughs> i found that out but yeah you guys um i'm gonna end the video here before it gets too too long please let me know anything you know below please don't forget to like subscribe goodbye guys